Maybe we'll teach you that lesson some other time. Thanks. That was really great. Sure. I'll see you later. Hey! Um, I'm Kimberly. You're new around here, aren't you? Yeah, I'm Tommy. Hi. Hi. Um, listen, do you want to get together with some of us after school? You know, nothing major, just hang out at the youth center? Yeah, that sounds cool. Okay. Well, I'll see you then. Bye. Bye. You gonna be okay? Yeah, I'll be fine. The guys want to take you out to lunch, but uh, I gotta go and take care of something. Can I drop this stuff off at your house? No, just toss it. I don't need it around to remind me of the parade. Yeah, okay. I'll catch you later. Bye. I thought I said I didn't want to watch the parade. But you have to. Here's a special award winner designed by a high school student from Angel Grove High. It symbolizes world peace and togetherness. This float competed against hundreds from all over the country, and I'm told due to Rita Repulsa's float? last attack... Is that my float? Tommy put it back together in time. Thank you, Tommy. Well, how about if I walk you home after school? Well, you know anything could happen. Hey, I'll take my chances. Okay. See ya. Bye. Bye. I mean, it's, it's really weird. It's like, I never know what's going to happen next. I see what you mean. Sorry. Thanks. I don't know what else to say. Absolutely nothing. Just know that you mean a lot to us. Let's do it. Stay in contact, Rangers, and be careful. How are you doing? I'm hanging. I've been working on my karate, focusing on my school. I'm just trying to keep busy, you know? We miss you. Yeah. Well, you guys were a team long before I showed up. But I'll be back to normal before long. I miss you. I've been wanting to do that for a long time. <laughs> Me too. Ah, <sighs> oh, now that's over with. I guess my next question is a piece of cake. What's that? Kimberly, will you be my date for the dance Saturday night? Well, Kimberly. <laughs> I didn't want to make it too easy for you. Of course, I'll be your date to the dance. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> Kimberly, are you all right? Yeah, but he got the others. We gotta help them. I know. That's why I'm here. Stay back. I'll get the schoon. Okay. Tommy, be careful. What was I thinking? Kim, I'm so sorry. Me too. Gosh, I said some really terrible things, didn't I? <laughs> I would never do anything to hurt you. You know that, right? Of course I do. Wow, where'd you get this? Arizona. Do you like it? Yeah, it's incredible. I know exactly where I'm going to put it. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. What beauty? What magnificence? Where did you come from, fair lady of my dreams? It worked! Oh, said dear, you remember me. Rita Repulsa, one of your faithful and humble servants! Rita, yes, Rita, Rita of the stars, of the sun, of the universe! I've been seeking you for so long. I love you, fair creature. Say you'll be my wife! <laughs> okay, and you and I will finally have control of the whole universe! <laughs> Yes, my little beetle blossom. You and I, together forever. And as my 
my wedding gift to you, I have managed to capture those pesky Power Rangers in an abandoned theater! Full of monsters! And no way out! Ah, I'll wait till you <laughs> conniving little cantaloupe. If I had a heart, it would be bursting with evil glee right now! Rita, Yes! Uh, I mean, I do. Uh, who has the ring? The ring. You're holding it, Sheehan! Give me that! Here you go, Zedekin! <laughs> Put this on! Okay, go ahead! By the powers vested in me by Lord Zed, I now pronounce you husband and fight. I, I mean wife. Go ahead and kiss. Come here, my little prickly pear. Do I have to? <laughs> yes. My hmm. wedding gift did you get for me? My gift to you is the Power Rangers trap. Your gift to me? I'd like to be there when the Power Rangers are destroyed. <laughs> <laughs> you shall have it. We will go together for a honeymoon aboard Serpent Terror, and together we will put an end to the Power Rangers forever. <laughs> <laughs> Rita, my love, you dance so lightly on my feet. My unhappiness is so complete, it feels like a mere matter of moments. Does it feel that way to you, my little sour apple? Seems more like a century. <laughs> Ew. Would you mind moving back? By the power and force of lightning, make a monster grow! Which one's got the special powers? Will the garden guys did all the lanterns we special? Fortunately, I have a natural gift for sensing extraordinary powers. That's true. You did choose me. <laughs> Get real. I knew Adam's loyalty to that silly lantern would make him unable to fight. <laughs> so, I knew that too. I knew first, but he's giving track. <laughs> something I could say to make you feel better, but I know there isn't. Thanks anyway. Will you call one of us if you need to talk? Yeah, sure. No problem. Take care. Cat? Ah, oh, Mr. Oliver, your table is ready. I don't understand. You did all this? Please, be seated. Thanks. Cat, wow, you, you look amazing. I have an idea. <laughs> this ought to be amusing. There's only one thing left to do. Be careful. Zia one, power down. Huh? What? Catherine, are you sure you know what you're doing? He has to see us. He has to be confronted with the face of his real friends. All right. Do not try to deceive me. Tommy, don't do this. Please. It's me, Catherine. Is Jason okay? Ah, uh, yeah, hello. Hey, there's more to life than saving the world, right? Yeah, I'd agree with that. <laughs> <laughs> Meet me at Angel Grove Park, signed a friend. Friend. Phantom Ranger. Hello? Anyone there? It's only me. <laughs> you scared me for a minute. One thing that will bring her back to life. My power, Roby. Is it doing anything? I don't know. Maybe. Look! Her color's back! <laughs> Now's your chance! Get out of here! Get her! I'll be back. Thank you. No, thank you. 
leaving us? I go where I am needed, and stay as long as I am needed. So, if we need you again? I will always remember you. <laughs> You're human. What'd you expect? I don't know. I mean... You're not from Earth, are you? Earth isn't the only place where humans live. I'm from a space colony, KO-35. It's in the Korova system. Shuttle's ready to go. It's programmed to take you home. Well, how about you? I mean, do you ever go home? To KO-35? No. Here. You don't like accepting help, do you? What are you thinking about? My sister, Caron. Last time I saw her was in that parkway over there. Something tells me I'm really close to finding her. I hope you're right. Come on. Actually, happy birthday, Ashley. Wow. Stone's a rare gem from KL35. I hope you like it. I love it. Thank you. Wanna go watch a lunar eclipse? <sighs> it's too serious. Hey, Ashley, do you want to go check out Haley's Comet? No, everyone's done that. <laughs> okay, let's try it one more time. Focus your thoughts. One more thing. Ashley, when she was with me, she spent most of the time asking questions about you. Questions? Like what? Maybe it'd be too boring for you, since you do come from space. But... Do you want to go check out Haley's comment with me? I'd love to. Get the others, and we all take a break. What do you have in mind? <laughs> Here. <laughs> Let me show you. There you go. You like it? <laughs> you look very nice. You look like Stella Quasinella. Really? Yeah. Wow. Wait, who's Stella Quasinella? She's an intergalactic star. She was in all the big holographic films. Wow. <laughs> if I don't see you again... I will see you again. Right.
Decca, set a course for Earth. Andros! Is that all you've got? I was expecting more this time. Oh, well, do it myself! Uh. Yeah! Good one! Uh. Uh. Super Silverizer! Yeah! doing here try this it's good for you mm, yuck okay so I'm not the best cook in the world maybe it needs a little more salt I could destroy you right now you know that don't you you could, but I don't think you will. Here, try this. Let me show you something. Hey, just what do you think you're doing? It's called toasting marshmallows. Try it. <laughs> it's good, huh? I'm sorry, let me help you with that. I'm so clumsy. <laughs> no, it's totally my fault. Oh. Ow. Uh. Ow. <laughs> wow. What? For a minute there, I thought you were somebody else. I've got to catch up with my friends. See ya. myself pretty good too. <laughs> What's the matter? You look like you just seen a ghost. I... Sure. Huh? 
Really? You think I'm great? Well, yeah, you're pretty good. Whoa, 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 you just said great, not just pretty good. Well, I meant above average. Barely. Because I bet I'm tougher than that tree. Come on, I bet I could show you a thing or two. Huh? Come on. Really? Yeah. <laughs> oh! <laughs> No, I'm not Alex. But I don't want you to be like him. In fact, I like you just the way you are. You do? Yeah, I do. Yes! Yes! What, you still don't trust me? Yeah, I do. <laughs> you know, I've been thinking, Jen. You really did a number on Contemptra. Because I have never seen you fight that way before. What do you mean? Well, it, it was almost like it was personal or something. That's ridiculous. She was just another mutant. Yeah, but come on, she was a babe in human form. Really? So that's your type? <laughs> no. Come on, I was just kidding. Actually, my type is more like... Like... Please, Jen, you've got to remember. All Time Force officers, you've got to stick together. We're all Time Force officers. Do you trust me? Trust me. Yeah, I trust you. Hey, Jen. <laughs> something I wanted to talk to you about. Really? There's something I wanted to talk to you about, too. Oh, well, why don't you go first? Oh, no, no, you go first. <laughs> well, uh, no, you go first. No, <laughs> really. Somebody go first. You're both driving me crazy. Well, I was just gonna ask if... Hey! <sighs> I should have told you this a long time ago. I love you. I love you too. I wish I could live another thousand years so we could be together again. <laughs> Thank you. So, did you give her a ticket? Yep. I could just tell she was... I recognize him from somewhere. Hey! You're the one who gave me a ticket this morning. We just helped you. The least you could do is say thanks. 
No. Taylor especially liked the Quantum Ranger, huh? Yeah! <laughs> Max! And I've got some information that I think is gonna help. I found out that those three monsters that attacked you guys earlier are not just me. Got some interesting friends. They drive me crazy sometimes. I'm sorry. I used to feel the same way about my friends. Always working. Yep. Can I see that? Yeah, sure. Now, this isn't your uh, standard issue Silver Guardian weapon here. This is one of a kind the Quantum Defender. Uh, hey, be careful with that now. That's not a toy, you know. Hey, I was in the Air Force. I could probably teach you a few things about this. It's fine. Fine? Yeah. What is it? It's nothing. Well, it looks like something to me. Is this a book? Just a book? Yeah, it's sure. just a book. Watch out for it. <gasps> Give oh, me that. I've read this book. Corey, Hunter, and Blake. Hey, hey, how's it going? Pretty good. Good. Dustin's told us a lot about you. But not everything. Corey is fine. Yeah. <laughs> Eat some beach. Run! Blake? I'll distract him. No! Stop! Don't! Listen, uh, thanks for what you did back there. And I don't know what happened. Uh, I guess I just blacked out. Yeah, you took a nasty fall. You're actually pretty lucky. I feel like a chump. I mean, I try to save you, and you end up saving me instead. Forget it. It's no big deal. Deal? <laughs> Blake? What? You... You totally freaked me out. I thought you were one of Lothor's goons. Since when do they ride dirt bikes? You never know. Where have you been, anyway? You don't call, no letter. You missed me, didn't you? No. Yeah, you did. I can tell. I don't like you anymore, and I'm not talking to you ever again. Hey, hey. Listen, um, what are you gonna be doing? You, you wanna come? Sure. I love those old kung fu movies. Oh, great. Uh, then uh, why don't you meet us tomorrow at the theater around 3? Three? 3. Got it. See you then. Great. The love hangover. I hope I never fall in love again. Yeah, I heard that. Oh. Um, I mean, at least not while under uh, a spell. So what were you going to tell me when you said it's time for her to know the truth? Um... A story. Well, not the part where I totally bagged on you, no. But you did. No. It would never, ever happen. How do you know? Because no matter what dimension we were in, I'd still like... Uh, like you. Ah, <laughs> uh, wow. Well. Hey, listen, what, what were you doing showing off anyways, huh? It's not like you need to prove yourself to a bunch of muscle heads. Okay, that was dumb. But they just made me so mad. Well... You could have really been her. From now on, no more surfing without a buddy, all right? All right. You ready, then? Re ready? Ready for what? You just volunteered. What? Come on. Whoa! Wait! Wait, 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 wait! Quick! Come on, quick! Ready? Ready? OK. Just try standing up, right? One, two, three, go! One, two, three, go! Following you like that. 
if I'd known you were training. Look, you don't have to apologize. Besides, you're kind of cute when you're jealous. Jealous? No way was I jealous. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Whatever you say. <laughs> I just thought it seemed like you needed help. <laughs> help? Mm -hmm. <laughs> or I'll show you who needs help. <laughs> Who is that? I don't know. Hello, anyone in there? He's really, wow, in me. Can I get you a glass of water, maybe an oxygen mask? Quiet, he's coming over here. Hey, I'm looking for Haley. I'm supposed to start work today. She's around here somewhere. Haven't I seen you at Reefside? Yeah, I just moved here last week. My name's Trent. I'm Ethan, this is Kira. Hey, <laughs> are you okay? She doesn't speak. We've been trying for years, but we just can't get through. I'm fine. It's nice to meet you. Hey. Where'd you go? I'm sorry. I shouldn't have just taken off like that. Look, I can't help you if I don't know what's going on. Trent, if you're going to dream about being a superhero, the White Ranger is not who you want to be. And I wish I had a choice. What are you saying? You? But you almost annihilated me. But I didn't. Look, once I knew it was you... Let go of me! Kira, I couldn't help it. The gem, it's changed me. I can't take it off or control what I'm doing. You gotta believe me. Why should I? Because I would never intentionally hurt anyone, Kira. But especially you. Okay. I think I know some people who can help. I know I got a lot to make up for, but I promise, this time I won't let you down. Well, I guess everyone deserves one last chance. Hey. You sure could use your help back there. I don't think there was anything I could have done. So, while we're out in the world fighting evil, what are you gonna do? Well, first, I'm gonna fix my bike. Then I'll head to my grandparents and see if I can live there instead of with my sister in Briarwood. No parents? Oh, you are nosy. Yes, I have parents. They're working overseas for a few years. I was living with my cousins for a while, then my uncle, now my sister. Uh, must be hard leaving friends all the time. Usually don't stay around long enough to have friends. You know, you could. I mean, you could stay somewhere longer. You know, like here, maybe. I'd love to hang and talk to you all day, but I still got a lot of work to do on my bike and Oh yeah, I'm sorry. I just I was I was trying. Um I'm gonna leave you to it. Hey, look. I I really appreciate what you're trying to do, I'm trying to say, but I guess I'm just not cut out for this magic stuff like you guys. But good luck. Yeah. You too. Gotcha! Oh, no. <laughs> Get that thing away from me. Oh, come on, Nick. Don't be shy. Me? I'm not the one who's always hiding behind that camera. <laughs> I'm not hiding. I've watched you, Madison. You're so busy filming other people having fun. You never get out there and have fun yourself. I have fun. Yeah? Yeah. When's the last time you went out there and did something different, something spontaneous? Spontaneous. OK. Yesterday, I went to buy toothpaste. I always buy peppermint, and I thought, no, I'm going to do something different. And I bought winter green. Winter green? Yeah, I... winter green. <laughs> You're a wild woman, all right? I'm gonna get you out of this, Maddie. I promise. I was a jerk. I'm sorry I said you were too shy. Apology accepted. Let's just forget about it. Your blanket? Isn't that a baby blanket? <laughs> oh, <laughs> you've kept it since you were a baby? Oh, that's cute. He's cute. <laughs> Don't you say that. Don't you say that. Not you. You have held us together through all of this. You will not give up. Listen to me! 
Giving up is not an option for you. We are a team and you are this team's leader. We go on no matter what. You're leaving. Yeah. I'm going to see my adopted parents. There's a lot to tell them. <laughs> so you're not coming back? I didn't say that. You are coming back. Uh, what I'm saying is that uh, I'd like to come back if there was something or someone to come back for. Uh, well, there is. There's Xander, Vita, Chip, um, Toby, Phineas, Lily, and, um, um, and me. I, I want you to come back for me. Daishi, you're so strong and so powerful. Make yourself useful, Camilla. And so not into me. Daishi! <laughs> You pestering lizard! You are a nuisance and a distraction! No! How dare you! One will help you. Your luck has run out. I ask that she be speared, Overlord Delica. She can still be of use. She doesn't, but I do. Who are you? Jared. The human? Are you okay? I am defeated. They are too strong. I'm stronger. No! So, now you stand with the humans, you will also fall with them. There's no chance left for me. Don't say that. I've seen the real Jared, and he's not evil. Are you okay? I'm barely okay. I'm good. Don't you want a little old to be taking a beginner's class? <laughs> it's never too late to start over. So true. I'm the best. Too bad Casey doesn't have someone amazing like that to teach him. I'm gonna need your help, though. It takes three. Wanna throw me? Wanna catch me? I'll okay. catch you. Still a minute on the clock. Only you would think that you could come back from 20 points behind. Lily, I've known you for a long time. I know what's bothering you. She played me, Theo. She totally played me. I know it feels that way, but you should never feel badly about reaching out to someone. Well, maybe she's right. Maybe I am a fool for always seeing the bright side of things. No way! That's one of the things I like most about you. Really? Yeah. I mean, we all like that about you. Besides, Camille's the one missing out. She doesn't have any friends. Assuming the evil monsters she hangs out with aren't exactly party animals. I think you guys need to be a little more considerate, like Lily. No, we don't. Lily's considerate enough for all of us. You know our standing Tuesday lunch an appointment? Yeah. Well, what would you say if sometime we turn that appointment into a date? I'd say... 
What took you so long? Hey, I don't know how to thank you. You can start with some gas, maybe some water, and I'll be on my way. Your question? That's it. Do you have to work really hard at the whole brooding bad boy thing? Like, seriously, do you get up and practice every morning in front of the mirror? I'm Summer. Dylan. You can call me Dylan. And can I ask you another question, Look, Dylan? I'm telling you people the truth. I don't know who I am or where I came from. I don't from. care where you came from. I want to know where you're going. That's enough! Dylan! That's Summer's family. I don't care who they are. No one comes in here and tells Summer what to do. <laughs> hey, any nice dreams? I'm having one right now. Ranger up. I understand your dilemma. Sorry, what dilemma? You find Ranger Series Red attractive because he represents the guy who can give you solid security. The boy next door. Trustworthy, responsible, the kind you take home to mother. At the same time, you're hopelessly drawn to the excitement and danger of Ranger Series Black. The tortured and mysterious bad boy you think you can save. I don't think you... Comparing the raw data on a cuteness scale is also difficult. One scoring a solid 9, but the other registering the cuteness scale's maximum score of 10. Which one do you think is a 10? Why? Which one do you think is the 10? Dylan. All for Dylan. Well, Ranger Yellow, I guess that pretty much answers the statistical question regarding the number 10 we were discussing earlier, has it not? No. Uh, uh, Dylan! No. If we don't get out of here now... You're right. You need to go now. I'm not leaving here without you. Why are you always trying to save because me? Because you're worth saving. <laughs> Looks like neither of us is leaving. Don't ever drive my car. Ever. Don't fall asleep on the job, and I won't have to. You want some juice? Uh, no. You okay? Just tired. We're nightmares. Well, uh, I hate to break this up, but uh, we gotta get going. Sorry, going where? We have no idea. But somewhere out there, there's a world waiting to be rebuilt. Why are you staring at me? I thought you'd be a dude. Excuse me? Well, you know, the whole K screen and the electronic voice, I was... I would have laid odds that you were a dude. Sorry to disappoint you. It's hard. Look, if you just got to know me... I don't want to get to know you. But why not? I'm a person. Turns out you're a person. I mean, give me one good reason why the two of us can can be friends. I don't like you. What's that supposed to be? That's an excellent question. Ah! Are there any more questions? Just uh, take it easy, little lady. What, what is it exactly that, that you want? I want him. Scanning interrupted. <laughs> and you. Uh... I had the strangest dream. We... We were on a date. Uh, that sounds like a nightmare. I'll go. You. You'll come outside with me. Okay. Was I unclear? No, not at all. Let's go. Don't worry, I can 
Okay, I got you covered. I feel better already. You don't smile much. And frowns are not good for you. Oh, yeah, because there's so much to smile about. <laughs> hey, ow! Ah. Now, I have completed this handy-dandy device for the Rangers. The best team money can buy. Apart from Green, he's... he's terrible. A smile. I did it. Yeah. Give me one good reason why the two of us can can be friends. I don't like you. What is it exactly that, that you want? I want him. I had the strangest dream. We were on a date. Uh, that sounds like a nightmare. You too, Ranger Series Green. It's Ziggy. Zig E. Z I G G Y. Password accepted. Summer. Oh, oh, summer. summer. What? Doctor K. Ziggy. Ziggy, what? Doctor K. Stop being sorry. You have nothing to be sorry about. It's my fault. Here I am trying to be stronger than Jaden, then I lose to you. You keep calling yourself insecure, so what does that make me? It was jerky when I was so hard on you. Bush League move, you split pea uh, punk! Quick! Now! With pleasure! Yeah. Ha! Simple power! Stone! Time to shut your pie hole! <laughs> now we're rocking! <laughs> yep. uh, I've got nothing nice to say to you, so let's call it a day. <laughs> Emily, wake up! You did it! The way she fought off that Nylock rocked! Girls got guts. Her sister would be proud. Em! Emily's awake! <sighs> Sorry, guys. I let him get me. Don't be silly. We're just glad you're okay. Here. Emily! <gasps> Mike! Look after her. Nylock! Come on, you coward! You can't do this to Emily! Do you hear me? Stop! Calm down! That won't do anything! Then what should we do? Tell me, what should we do? I'll do it. Wait. It's our mission to save the entire world. We can't just... Then you stay behind. Emily's the best of us. She has the sweetest, most caring spirit. And I won't let that Nylock keep it. Mike, I know how much you care about Emily. We all do. But remember, it's our duty to protect and save the many. The one I want to save right now is Emily. And I'll do whatever it takes. Wow. I feel so bad for him. I still don't trust him. And I don't like the way he looks at you. He's wearing a helmet. How could you tell? <laughs> I could just tell. Besides, you won't be by yourself. But what happened to the others? I, I can't let that happen to you. Nothing's going to happen to me. We'll beat this Nylock together. <sighs> wow, we really did it. Just the two of us. Yeah, let's never do that again. <laughs> <laughs> it's a deal. <laughs> Good.
No major plans. I'm just excited I get to go home and take care of my sister. There's no other place I'd rather be than home with family. <laughs> Mike? Tell him where you're going. <laughs> Kinda thought I'd go with Emily. What? You know, in case she needs help moving her stuff. <laughs> Come on, dude! Gia's having Ernie's brain freeze. Let's motor! Jake, she is the hottest girl at this school. Do you really think you have a chance? Let's go! <sighs> oh, it's only you. Well, I guess I've had worse reactions. I don't want some random kid to see my morpher. I just wanted to ask if I could walk you home. What, you afraid to walk by yourself? No, um, I just wanted to talk to you, you know, about this weekend. So, what do you want to talk to me about? Well, since we're teammates now, I thought maybe we should get to know each other a little better, socially. Whoa, time out. Listen, Jake, you're probably a great guy. In fact, I think you're out of this world. Really? Whoa. This is so not what I expected. <sighs> I must be dreaming. Oh, we had a pretty good team out there. A couple hardcore monster busters. You're really gonna go there? I saved your bacon at least twice, monster buster. And share your sweet perfume, flowers blue. Troy, what are you doing here? Sorry, I saw you earlier, but you didn't hear me. Wow, Emma. You're an incredible singer. Thanks. I get that from my mom. I remember she'd sing that song each year when the trees came into bloom. It's probably where my love of nature came from. Singing to the trees reminds me of her. I didn't know Emma could sing. What is it? It's a Haldeman and click beetle. It's really rare. Thank you. Cool. What a guy. <laughs> nice moves, bro. <laughs> Here, do something useful instead. <laughs> hey. Did you convince Robonite to work with us? No. The robot is stubborn. Why can't he see that we're fighting on the same side? I'm sure he'll come around. No one can resist the call of the Red Ranger for long. <laughs> come on, dear. Yeah. Come on. Come on, just one dance. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> the other guy, I think that pretty much answers your question. Yes. <laughs> you know, Jake. You made it look so easy to ask someone you like out on a date. Maybe you should follow your own advice. Well, Gia. <clears throat> Would you maybe want to? Guys, guys, guys. Think again! No! Give that back! Are you okay? Hi. I'm Tyler Navarro. Nice to meet you, uh... Shelby, uh... Triceratops. Catchy name. Oop, on the hole. She's down there with the Ankylosaurid? Huh. Oh no! Shelby! She's really smart. And hey, I think she's cute. No, one not left to right. I've already uh -huh. calibrated it to search right to left. And... kinda stubborn. I have something of yours. You found my dad's bracelet.
Thanks. No problem. <laughs> awesome, isn't it? Maybe I should play the princess. <laughs> Just so we can get the terror charger back. Maybe I should take your arm. Uh, okay. Can we get a kiss? Let me give it a go. My dad taught me how to do it. And just walk with it. It's so pretty. <laughs> I swear that's not what Super my dad mad. taught me. Here, let's. Here, just Super take a seat right here. Let's tilt your head back. Just a little bit of water. Okay. Yes, my dad, are, are you okay? Here, let me get I'm it for you. I can try. Are you, I'm fine. Are you sure? I'm fine. Are you sure you got all the soap out? Yeah. Let's just have something to eat. Great. I'm starving. Oh, that looks really good. Did you make this? Uh huh. <laughs> Ants! <gasps> oh, they're everywhere! Uh, ah, they're, they're in my clothes! Ah. 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 Oh. Ah. <laughs> I think I got them all. You good? Yeah. Talk about a terrible date. I, I mean... Uh, a date? Is that what you think this is? No. Awesome. Huh. So is yours. <laughs> that was terrible. I'm not talking about your singing. Talking about your courage. You were scared to death, but you got up there and sang anyway. I don't know how you did it. I, I did it because I thought you, uh, um, <clears throat> you thought I, what? You were so gaga over Rada, the NZ boy. I, I just thought maybe if, if I could sing, you'd like me too. Tyler, the Silver Ranger almost fooled us, but you figured out he was lying. You found the bug you planted on your dino comm, and, and now you're about to fight Doomwing just to give us a chance to set Xenowing free. Don't you see? Even if you never sang or danced, to me, you're a total rock star. Nitro's feeling much better, so she's gonna run just fine. Aren't you, baby? Yes, she You is. do know that I'm your girlfriend, and that Nitro is just a truck. Shh. It hurt her feelings. <laughs> How much? What is this stuff? Ah. They don't look like parts from an airplane. Maybe a top secret satellite? Yeah, I guess. Or maybe. It's an alien! Oh, you creeped out! Oh. Let's just clear the road so we can get out of here. Yeah. It's okay. Just tell them. I don't know how to drive. I'm his personal chauffeur. You just never noticed. I don't get it. I should have never ditched you. I hope you can forgive me. We all make mistakes. What matters is what you do to correct them. And helping us work. The same way I can make our school a better place if you elect me as your president. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Uh, don't forget to vote. That was actually a pretty good speech. If I wasn't running for president, I'd absolutely vote for you. <laughs> Thanks, that's really sweet. Look, I said some dumb things. You're not too laid back. You've done a pretty amazing job. I'm sorry. Don't apologize. Sometimes I am a little lax, and I should have been on time to pick you up. Sorry about that. No problem. First rate dinner tonight. <laughs> Can you believe it? We've been together for two whole years. <laughs> oh, Nitro. 
Uh, this is great. Thank you. Uh, dinner? What about, uh... uh... And I... I got you a present too, of course. Um, I'm, I'm uh, saving it for our dinner. Ooh! Let you down. And I didn't want to see your face all... sad. I don't care about the present. You're forgetful, I know that. And sometimes you're late. Sometimes you have grease on your hands. <laughs> but those are the things that I love about you. But yeah, it does make me sad when you lie to me. I'm so sorry, Haley. Can you forgive me? Of course I can. No lie. It's our lucky day. Hi. We would like one mushroom pineapple pepperoni pizza, please, with extra sauce. <laughs> That's your fancy anniversary meal? <laughs> pizza from the snack stop. Yep. Same as last year. It's our favorite. It's a tradition now. <laughs> Look, I still feel pretty bad about not getting you a gift. So, to make up for it, I made you something. What? You made something for me? <laughs> really? Oh, the calendar with pictures of us. <laughs> oh, it's so thoughtful, Kelvin. Oh, look how cute. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is so sweet. Thank you. There's two of them. Yep. This one's for me, though. I circled our anniversary date so that I never forget again. <sighs> Thank you. Yeah. It's good to have friends, especially when you're in a bind. We all have each other's backs. It's what I always thought a family would be like. What do you mean, would be like? You have a family, don't you? Sort of. My mom and dad work overseas, so I don't really see them much. Brothers and sisters? Nope. It's just me. I always wanted a brother. But I have you rangers now. What kind of ranger am I if I can't save your buddy and his friends? You'll find a way to solve it. Zoe, these are right for you. Thanks. To Zoe, from your secret Valentine. Who sent these? No idea. <gasps> Here, it's kind of chilly. Oh. Thanks. Let's go. So, which assistant did you hire? Honestly, I didn't hire one yet. You're a better judge of character than I am. Can you pick one for me, fast? Sure, no problem. I can always count on you. Thanks, Zoe. <laughs> I'd like a vitamin rehydrator, please. Sure thing. Can I just say, I'm sorry about Megan. I don't get why you let her blackmail you. We just ran into each other at the movies. We weren't on a date. Were we? Thing is, I heard you say that you were going to that movie, so I kind of decided to go, too, so that we could see it together. I guess for me, it kind of was a date. It was? We were? Fact is, I sort of like like you. You know? That's phenomenal, because I sort of like, like you too. You do. Remember those Valentine's Day flowers someone sent you? Well... <laughs> that was you? Well, now I feel bad that I didn't get you anything. <laughs> and then I said, what robot? You must have me confused with some other specimen. What are we gonna do? Clearly, it's a tricky one. Hey, what do you think they're talking about? Megan said they went on a date. My brother? Do you think? Hmm. No. Nah! No, no way. No. Zoe? Check out these diagnostics from the Chopper Zord's controls. Something's off. You're right. 
I'll double check your entire system tonight. Tonight? Really? But you said you were exhausted. Anything you need, Zoe. No problem. Anything happen? Nothing. Ah, oh, that ramen smells good. I'm starving. I was thinking, uh, I know this isn't a date, but it's nice hanging out. Just you and me. Yeah, it is. Noodles, eh? Hmm. Well, hello. Just what I need. Uh, uh. Oh, I'm so clumsy. No worries. Here, we get your mine. Thanks. Yes, my work here is done. Commander, we haven't been dating. We may disagree with the rule, but we're not going to break it if it means jeopardizing the team. <coughs> I believe you, Nate. I saw the way you two fought together today. And it's clear to me now, you're a great team because of your relationships, not in spite of them. I don't change the rules often, but when I do, it's only for a good reason. Does that mean? Yes, Dale, it does. The rule is toast, as you might say. Ha! I did it! You two can be together! <laughs> yes. So, you want to see a movie tonight? Affirmative. It's a date. We can start with the psychic. Fine. But who's going to waste 15 bucks on a psychic? Don't worry. I'll get the money. Ollie, can I borrow 15 bucks? I was just wondering. Amelia and I are super in love, so... Ollie, what are you... Shh. Honey Muffin. I just have a simple question. Tell us about our future, together. Oh. <laughs> oh. I see you've had a long and happy relationship with many more years to come. Long and happy? Us? Hey, guys. I had no idea you two were in love. We're not. Definitely not. But Ollie called you Honey Muffin. Yeah, and it was really hard not to throw up in my mouth when he did. Same here. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. I can't believe you said something I actually agree with. Guys, pinch me. Prude. Haunted Egyptian pyramids, huh? You know I've been there, right? No ghosts, just sad. I, I tried. To warn me. I know. I thought I knew better. There's no time. We have to save everyone, including Solon, right? Yeah, but I can't make this antidote alone. No problem. I'll help you. You needed these slides? Sure. Why not? Come on. I'm sorry. I mean, how will your energy base help? Well, it's made with magnets, and it's been a while since science class, but... Magnets attract iron molecules. Great idea. Hey. Hey. I just wanted to say thank you for your help with the antidote. I couldn't have done it without you. You know, we make a pretty good team. Yeah, true. That's why I'm really sorry for mocking your bracelet and all the other things I made fun of. I respect you, and I shouldn't have been such a jerk. Apology accepted. You know this doesn't change anything. Let me guess. You're still gonna prove ghosts are real. You bet. And you're gonna help. 
I already ordered you a spook snare. I hope pink's okay. It's the only color they have. It's fine. I can deal with pink. Thanks for the bailout. Hey, Izzy, quick question. <sighs> great. Just great. Oh, Amelia. <sighs> What's up with her today? What do you think? Uh, it's got nothing to do with me. Unless maybe she wanted to be your Valentine? Wait, really? You think so? Cause I... Uh... I gotta tell you something. Stella doesn't exist. The flowers were actually for Amelia because I... I like her. <laughs> I totally called it. What do you mean? It's been pretty obvious for a while, dude. You two have a vibe. A vibe? Mm. <laughs> Dear Amelia, wishing you a happy Valentine's Day. I hope you like daisies. From Ollie. Ollie. I don't know what I'll do if we can't help you. Ollie, I, I know you wanted to tell me something earlier, but never got the chance. I just wish I didn't react the way I did. The truth is, I like you. I really do. Ollie? Did you just say you like me? Uh, uh, how much of that did you hear? Enough. And I feel the same. I kind of figured that out. If I just told you that, none of this would have happened. Hey, at least we know now. What you doing? Nothing. Nothing. So, sorry for trying to destroy you and stuff earlier. Don't worry. You couldn't have beaten us on your own anyway. We're just glad to have you back. And that things with you two are good. Looks like Amelia really is Ollie's honey muffin now. <laughs> <laughs> you know prophecies aren't real, right? They're kind of like psychics, which last time we checked are a total fraud. That reminds me. Didn't Madame Indigo say something about us? A long and happy relationship? That was just a lucky guess. Reported ghost sightings. And even better, they have room service. So we can get hot chocolate at 3 a.m. from the most haunted hotel on the coast? Perfect. I am so ready. Look what came in the mail. An electromagnetic frequency sensor? Yep. Every ghost hunter has this exact same model. So if something spooky goes on in that hotel, we'll know. Not a bad idea for date night, huh? The best. You okay? I messed up. Those little mistakes, that was me. Mom thought she could rely on me to help out, and now she's had to cover for me. She's right. You're right. I've been taking her for granted. I mean, you're the one who told me to tell Amelia the truth. That was solid advice. Yep, we find each other way less annoying now. <laughs> Thank you, Izzy, but because of me, you're dead last. It's just a race. We needed help. Are you two okay? It's her ankle. Come on. You'll be okay. Yeah, I'm a pretty big fan of this place. Oh, yeah. I love their tacos. Um, so what's the special this week? Feel like ramen? My favorite. <laughs> Have fun, sis. Bye. See ya. Look at them. <laughs> it wasn't Kung Fugitive, actually. I wanted to ask, will you be my date to prom next week? Oh, shoot, you beat me to it. <laughs> I was going to ask you. So is that a yes, or? Of course it is.
Thanks, Mom. Way to give us heart attacks, though. <laughs> Sorry, but did I hear prom? This is so exciting. Now that is a look. Thanks to you, Rena. I love my dress. I couldn't have done it without Izzy. What are you doing, Dad? Uh, nothing. But I just want to get a couple of photos, you know, for the family album. Fine. <laughs> you look absolutely dashing, honey. Yeah, yeah. Okay, now smile, girls. OK, dear, that's enough. They'll be late. Isn't Javi giving you a tour ride? Yeah. Where is he? A limo? <laughs> no way! Sorry I'm late. Dude, this is amazing. It's kind of a shame the others aren't here. They'd love this. <laughs> Why do you say that? <laughs> Surprise! Mind if we come along for the ride? The snacks are free. <laughs> awesome, let's go. Oh, wait, before you go, one more photo. Dad. Fine, fine, okay. Great. OK, everybody say, uh, best dad ever. <laughs> come on. OK, Fern, you're at the last obstacle. Get ready to roll. That's a record for the Make the Date obstacle course. Everything okay? Ma'am, I can't find my girlfriend. We got separated, and she's not answering. I'm sure she's safe. But what if she got hurt? She just means so much to me, and I love her, and... I love her. I do. I haven't even said that out loud to her yet. What if something happens and I never get the chance? I promise. I'll make sure she's safe. Trust me. I should have told you about the Oakdale letter right away. Keeping it a secret was wrong. I'm so sorry. Do you know how that made me feel? It's not that you didn't tell me you didn't want to go. It's that it really seems like you don't want to go because of me. What? No, that's not it. But you've dreamed about this forever. What changed? I thought training at Oakdale together would have been a good thing. We'd have each other's backs. I wish I could explain it. All that matters is... I love you, too. You do? <laughs> Wait, what do you mean, too? I never told you, or anyone, except. I love her. I do. I haven't even said that out loud to her yet. Except the Green Ranger. It's you, you're the- If, if I was a Power Ranger, I couldn't tell anyone. Top secret. And a ranger couldn't join an elite sports program because they'd be way too busy protecting the entire city. Piloting Megazords being awesome. That would be a tough call if I was a ranger. Yeah, but I'd probably understand and keep it a secret. <laughs> Rangers, I don't fear you.